Computer coding is coming to a classroom near you. BC Premier Christy Clark announced Monday that the province is adding computer coding to the curriculum for students all the way from kindergarten to grade 12, starting as early as next year, which was welcome news to the teachers at North Peace Secondary School. I think it's fantastic. This is uh, the first that we've heard about it, so uh, it remains to be seen exactly how it's going to pan out. But I think the opportunities that uh, it presents for the students is fantastic. The plan, which will be introduced for all grades over the next three years, isn't just about getting kids to learn how to make computer programs and build apps. It's meant to help them learn new methods for problem solving. In essence, it's logical thought. It's, um, it's a simple, elegant way of thinking um, in order to create the programming. And so teaching that to students, especially from an early age, uh, kind of helps to guide their thinking and, uh, and improve their thought process. It's not that hard to understand some of the basics of problem solving and, and logically how to think your way through a problem or, or how, a, how a program is created. Uh, that way you're not going to consider computers magic. Not only that, but the technology sector, even in BC, is a booming industry undersupplied with qualified workers, something kids may not be aware of. If you know how to code, you can actually like create your own programs here at home. This is good for remote communities almost, where you don't have to move to a big center. So there is possibilities for this being useful for up here in the north. I'm excited about it. You know, I think the tech is, is definitely the way of the future. And uh, the more kids we can get involved and, and get them online, then definitely it'll be a good, uh, a good thing for us. The tech sector employs 86,000 people in BC, which is actually more than forestry, mining, and oil and gas combined. Peter Houston, CJDC-TV News, Fort St. John.